being an innovative company, we like to see what is happening in the, in the market and uh, the future of HVAC conference is an opportunity to mingle with other people who are also interested in what's happening uh, not only today but what's going on over the course of the, the next few years in our industry. So I attended the, uh, the first conference last year um, just as a participant and um, uh, got to learn a lot from that conference and got a heap out of it and thought I'd come back again this year. So far it's been great, the content's been good, the, the um, presenters have, have really presented the subject very, very well. It's a great opportunity to network with other people um, within our industry and also to keep up to date with what's going on. We saw it as a bit of an opportunity um, like as an Australian manufacturer and doing our own innovation and R&D in-house and things like that. Um, to keep in touch with what's going on in the industry. Well, as building design professionals, we're always looking forward. Uh, what we start working at now goes out into the world two, three, four, five years out, and it has a life of tens, twenties, hundreds of years sometimes. So we always need to look forward. This is a great venue to explore what's coming up. I've really appreciated the variety in the talks, um, hearing a bit about new technologies and also um, initiatives that I'm not always familiar with that people are starting to um, use in the industry. So yeah, it's been really informative. We've got some of the smartest minds in Australia in the industry here and uh, presenting on very relevant, interesting topics. I was very impressed with um, one talk there, Matthew from uh, Melbourne University. He was talking about uh, the relationship between biology and engineering and how we can learn so much from nature. There's been some real eye-openers for me, I think, around resilience. And uh, for me, I'm going to take that to my company, the idea of using plants as a pre-filter for VOCs and other things. So it's those types of things that we you know, want to be stimulating our thoughts about so we can take them back to our projects. I especially appreciate the diversity of topics, from very technical issues to very broad issues that face us as building design professionals. You look at the faces of the people coming out of the doors, uh, you can see it's really starting to shape some of their thinking. I think the future of HVAC conference uh, is really important. You know, we've got, we're a critical industry for, uh, for the infrastructure of Australia. With the intersection of, of academia, with the intersection of manufacturers, and I think it's becoming clear that, that one of the roles ERA can play is drawing all those people into a room together to hash out how we can improve the R&D and actually commercialise the innovation that we have in our industry. For me, ERA remains um, a bit of a leader in terms of the content they're able to provide within our industry. Um, it's not all about mechanical services and air conditioning, but that's um, uh, a good core, I guess, to address issues of sustainability in the future of HVAC.